sporting clay shoot kicked off Guide Dogs of America's 2017 charity events in Las Vegas. IAM Local Lodge 845 hosted the event at the Clark County Shooting Complex. Across town, at Las Vegas Harley-Davidson, more than 100 machinist members and their relatives hopped on bikes for the annual Hogs for Dogs motorcycle ride, sponsored by the IAM Western Territory. We should all do our part, and this here is one way I, I'm showing that, that uh, I'm more than willing and to do my part to help out a great cause. That cause is raising and training guide dogs to help blind and visually impaired men and women lead independent lives. It's enhanced my mobility and my ability to get around and things like that. But the real thing that it's done is it's, it's given me a sense of normalcy in that I used to be able to see before I lost my eyesight in 93. And it's given me that sense of normalcy in that when I walk down a street, I'm walking like I always did, not with a cane and tapping around, but I'm using my dog's eyes to get from one point to another. Goliath has changed Tom's life and the lives of his family members. That's why so many machinists volunteer for Guide Dogs of America. At District 70 in Wichita, we have a golf tournament, a bowling tournament. We also have some activities in the community we do. We do a national night out the community and we also do the angel tree program where we have adopted out last year we did 907 children this year we're going to try and do 1200 children so we feel that volunteerism is very important in our community and so we strive to do all the volunteering we can the motorcycle ride left the strip and winded its way onto the highway through the part of the mojave desert called the valley of fire named for its red Aztec sandstone. The next day, 215 fundraisers headed to Angel Park Golf Course for a charity tournament. Dogs in training were on hand, along with three full-fledged guide dogs. The week culminated with the 37th annual William W. Wimpisinger Charity Banquet Tailgate. This dinner and activities leading up to tonight continue to be the single largest fundraiser for GDA. Guide Dogs of America honored three recipients of the Gift of Sight Awards. Past GDA President Dale Hartford, Spirit Aero President Thomas Gentili, and IAM Transportation General Vice President Cito Pantoja. With nearly $2 million raised, all these annual charity events help Guide Dogs of America's puppy raisers, trainers, instructors, students, and guide dogs. It cost $48,000 to train each team and every little bit helps. In Las Vegas, I'm Tanya Hutchins.